What's up guys? So this is a video request that I just got from a guy that asked me a quick question. So I'm going to answer this question. What should I do when this girl is playing mind games with me? Now bro, you got a couple options here. So I think the smartest thing to do if a girl's playing mind games with you is to just leave her alone. Leave her be bro because the end result is never good. It's never good, bro. Girls that do this, they really want to get over on you, bro. Like, that's their end plan. It's to punish you. I'm fucking telling you this right now, bro. There's something sick <clears throat> about these females that want to do this shit. They really want to cause you pain at the end before they end things, they really want to put some pain on you, the girls that want to play mind games. And it's not hard to tell what are girls playing mind games. They're being fucking weird. And you even know that yourself, and you probably don't even have all the knowledge or experience in the world. Even you know this, bro. So, I say do that. The other option, play her back, bro. If you want to do that, do that, but I wouldn't do that. I don't do that dumb shit. Because that's taking time and focus off of you and your life. You could be putting that time into something much greater than this. Because you know where this is already going to go. Now, <clears throat> I know a lot of young guys like to talk to females. I know you guys do. I used to too when I was younger, but you see so much shit in your life, bro, it just ends up getting sickening and say, why the fuck would I even bother? If it's a waste of time and you know it's a waste of time, bro, I wouldn't do it. But if you really want to and you like to talk to females that much, which a lot of young guys do, Go with it, bro. Play her back. Make her your bitch. If she don't like your program, bro, she don't like your shit, she don't like your game, let her be. We ain't got time for this, bro. Come on now. We ain't got time for this shit. The truth of the matter is, the females that do this have nothing better to do with their life other than do senseless types of shit like this to whoever they can. And it gives them an ego boost. Makes their head huge. When they know they have power over you, bro, their ego goes to the roof. And trust me when I say this. I got with some females, bro. And just from doing that, without even talking to them at first, a while back, right? That made their head huge. They were all high and muddy for a long time after that. Until I stopped replying. Because you know what we gotta do, bro? <clears throat> we gotta stick a fucking pen or a needle in their big fucking head, big deflated head, inflated, and deflated, is what I should say. Right? Because her head's like this right now, bro. Blown up like a fucking balloon. We gotta stick something in that bitch to deflate that. You cannot let these girls have power over you, bro. That's what they want. They want to make you their bitch. I'm just keeping it real, guys. And you guys know that. Not all girls are like this. Not all females are like this. There's some good ones out there. They got a good head on their shoulders. That had enough of all this bullshit, too. 
just like us guys. It goes hand in hand. But I would say there are more crazier females because a lot of the crazier females make more crazier males. And they had enough too, but you know what? They like females so damn much that they're going to run around and do some stupid shit too to other females. And it's just a big old clusterfuck. And females, bro, are turning so many guys into simps because they just can't go on in life without talking to other females. So they choose to be simps. Beta male cucks, providers, doing anything to doing anything they can do in their power, just to talk to these girls, wasting all their time and their energy, bowing down and worshiping these females. It's fucking sad, isn't it? I just feel bad for these guys, bro. Honestly, I can do nothing but feel bad for these guys. Because they are, they are on a path to absolutely nowhere. Because this path that they're taking leads nowhere. It's not getting them nothing. They might think that. They might hope and pray. But, unfortunately, you are fucked, buddy. You want to go down that path? Say goodbye. Say goodbye. You know what you're going to have to do when you go down that path? You're going to have to crawl and weep your ass back to the start of that path to take a new one. Because that path was a trap. And you fell for it. you got to be careful when you're dealing with these females, bro. You have to know what's going on. And if you know what's going on, do what's right. There might be something inside of you that wants to play along with it or do something like this, right? Do what's right. Don't do what you want to do necessarily. But do what's right. Because guess what? Me, myself, I just love the party all the time. Wouldn't we all? We all get a bunch of free money. Let's just let loose and do whatever the fuck we want to do, right? That's going to fuck us all up, bro. That's going to ruin our lives. We're not going to be able to build nothing. You know what? We're not even going to be able to pay rent because we're fucking around this much. You have to get your shit together first. And maintain that. Because even when you have your shit together, you can fall off, bro. Once you get to the top, there ain't no slack. Because somebody else is climbing, bro. Whenever they get to the top, and you're sitting at the top, and you're weak, and they're not, they're going to push you off. And this is just how it is. So with these females, be very fucking careful. Because these girls say things all the time that they don't mean. You know how many times I've heard I love you, this and that, that and this, talking about forever, talking about having kids in our mid-twenties, early tw or mid-twenties, late-twenties at the latest, talking about all this stuff, bro, right? It's what people do. Nothing. Dead end. It's just, this is just why you got to be careful. Can they even talk to you about these things in person to your face, bro? Can you even go on a date with them in person, just you and them? And these conversations are the exact same as they are over text or over a phone call. Can they keep that same energy, bro? Pay attention to this shit. That's what you should be paying attention to. These females can text anything over text, bro. You can think they're feeling one way when they're texting you these certain things. But it's the complete opposite. This is a huge mistake I made when I was younger. Because I took people's words for what they said when I was younger. Until I learned that, oh fuck. Oh shit. 
there's motherfuckers out here that don't actually mean what they say. Holy shit. People actually lie. They actually do. Those dirty bastards. Yeah. People do do this. And I don't understand. Because what the fuck are they doing too? Where the, what the fuck are they accomplishing doing this bullshit? Absolutely nothing. Like, are you not focused on getting your shit straight in life? So you can live your best, happiest life with the best people? I don't understand, bro. People really fucking confuse me. Especially these dwabs. Fucking dweebs. That are just playing games all the time. They're not taking nothing seriously. They don't even take their real life seriously. Their career. Or whatever the fuck they're doing. They don't save money. They don't do shit. Everything is just a fucking joke to these people. So, if somebody crosses your path, some female, even some guy that's playing games, and you feel they're joking around, they're just playing these games, treat them as a joke, as they are, because that's what I do. Even whenever I sense little shit, I start treating these people like a joke, how they should be treated. You want to fucking waste my time? You want to come near my bubble? And waste my fucking time? I'll treat you how you deserve to be treated. Because honestly, that's disrespectful. I think it's disrespectful when people are lying. I think it's disrespectful when people are playing games. When they want to lead it on that it's going to be something that it's not. I think that's disrespectful. So here's your options. At the end of the day, you're still going to do whatever you're going to do, but just don't forget what I'm saying here. I'm out.